when I moved to Sunset Cove, I had just one feeling. Everyone seemed so perfect and yet totally wacko. Or was I the one who was weird? The teachers and students at Atlantis High had their share of problems. <laughs> Things threatened to get a little less complicated now that I'd persuaded Anthony to leave. Not a lot I could do about Josh Montana, though. Hey, going my way? No. He still hated me for being in love with Octavia. Don't mess with me, Giles. She's mine. She just doesn't know it yet. I guess he thought his best bet at impressing her was to let her see him in action as a silver lining. But who would have guessed my own mother would start acting weird? Well, some people would. Oh, silly me, I left my credit card behind. But snooping inside the Vermont's house? Hey. Strange enough behaviour. But if anyone had told us that miniaturised aliens were, at that very moment, being carried from place to place by a fly of all things, well, would you have believed it? Relatively speaking, the properties within a body are evenly distributed. But what can one do when all around things are bigger than you are? <laughs> exceptions in nature, and some of these we will attempt to explore today. You know, just because I'm not all dressed up doesn't mean that I'm not heartbroken too. No, all it means is she made it to the fancy dress shop before you did. Uh, it is generally accepted uh, that some species navigate by instinct. At what price instinct when you are lost and alone in an alien environment? <laughs> As I was saying... Hey, guys. Sorry I'm late, but the selection today was just too good. Do you hate to rummage around the supermarket's garbage? Well, it beats my mother's sandwiches any day. Besides, one person's nugget dip is the next person's beef hollandaise. So this is better. This has got fungus. Look. Great, Jet. Can I try some? Sure. Free and share, right? <laughs> appreciate this navigation process is very complex. The class will excuse me for just one moment. Soldiers doing? Never mind them. We better get to science. You know, it's how tense Mr. Dorsey is these days? Tense is a relative term. Yeah. Well, all my relatives suffer from it. I blame warm beer. Sorry, Jet, wait, wait, you lost me. Warm beer? No, it's just a theory. I haven't really developed it yet. Fresh lemon jelly marmalade with extra vitamin D. Coffee. 
Oh, go on. It's fresh ground Colombian decaf with chicory tips and extra pickup essence. No good commander should leave home without it. We've got them. Move out, man. And what these certain people don't realize is that other people have feelings too. Certain people who drive away other people's boyfriends, they're very selfish indeed. And what certain people don't realize is that some of us have friends, special friends who don't like me getting upset. Special poltergeist friends who sometimes like to throw things, like syrup jars at certain selfish people. Or, or sometimes things bigger than syrup jars, but right now a syrup jar will do. Why, thank you very much. So, have you seen Beanie? Oh, go boil your head. We'll uh, take that as a no. Come on, let's go. Giles, hey Jet, how's it going? What's with the bin lid? Nothing. Hey, buddy, share, remember? What's with them? What? Flying saucers. Yeah, yeah, they're flying saucers. Yeah. yeah, Beanie Man, launch those things. Don't encourage them. Hey, chill, man. Don't crush your guys' dreams. Where's the harm? Jet, he's standing on a table throwing things at people. So what? Do you want him to be as boringly normal as everyone else here? Normal? Okay, look, all I am saying is, is that... Oh, no, he's gone. Oh, no. Okay, it's okay, it's okay, 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 don't panic, okay, you kind of gone far. Um, okay, you go that way and I'll go this way, and if you, if you see him, uh, yell! This guy looks suspicious. Cover me, man. Sounder, this really is our one last distress signal. It really is our last chance. Nice day. Yeah. Ravini, no, no, no. But it's a shiny one. Look. Well, you can't do this, okay? This is a police car. Yeah, I hope you. Uh, my hub kit? Uh, it might be. I don't um, understand. Oh, my guy. You. You're a thief, and honest to goodness, thief. Wait. Stop. I know exactly what to do. Breathe deep, Costello. Don't go away. Oh, thank you. No few messages. Now, bear with me. I've seen this done before. Hold out your finger. Uh, uh, no, your wrist. There. Okay, okay, look at all of a second. You don't understand. Hey, like, you resist an arrest? You can smart with me, sonny boy. I'll throw the book at you. Excuse me, officer. Oh, Josh. The silver line. Allow me to offer my assistance as a decent 
God-fearing, ordinary superhero. The only arrest in Sunset Cove ever? Back off, buddy! He's mine! I, 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 Bainey, can you tell Jay what happened, okay? Sure, Giles. Have a good time. He makes friends so easily. Busy, babe? Yes, doing a report. Because your friend is. My friend? The one and only, Giles Gordon. Yeah, he's probably scratching chalk marks on his cell wall for the rest of his life. Excuse me? Don't worry, babe. His thieving days are over. That's ridiculous. Are you trying to tell me that Giles is in jail? It's true. I swear. You shouldn't. If Giles is in prison, there must be some logical explanation. After all, Giles isn't exactly a hell's biker now, is he? Hell's biker. You're not obliged to say anything, but anything you do say will be taken down, changed, and used in evidence against you in a court of law. All right now, boys. That crowd out there looks like it's getting mighty ugly. We just might find ourselves in a lynching situation. Excuse me, honey. Thank you very much. Okay, say this is Giles. This is Giles. No, 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 pretend this is Giles. Hey, Giles. Okay, now this is the police officer. Now, when Giles went away with him, the police officer wasn't taking Giles home for dinner. No? No. And that wasn't a present that the police officer gave to Giles. They're called handcuffs. So Giles isn't having a good time? Beanie, Giles has had his freedom taken away from him by someone who was paid to do that. It was bound to happen sooner or later. Low breeding, receding forehead, eyes too close together. Yeah, but zit free. What? We've got to do what we can to get Giles out of there, capiche? Sorry to call on you like this. I heard about Giles, and I wondered if there's anything I could do to help. Well, you could paint that door for a start. Fine. All this business with Giles must be a worry to you. I gotta say, I expected better of him. And I can't say I'm happy that the best he could do was hubcaps. I do understand. Uh, it's dribbling. Sorry. No, I blame his mother. We should never have come here. The temptation was just too much for his feeble mind. 
Well, don't get me wrong. I love my son, but hubcaps, please. How's that supposed to keep me in a pension in my old age? Oh, medication, father. Who are you? I'm Giles' friend. Can you keep a secret? Of course. Dennis thinks I'm past it. Dennis? But I got a plan to get Giles out of jail. Shh. There you go, melted chocolate. <coughs> oh, sorry, I forgot the sprinkles. The string of related thefts across the state might indicate that Giles Gordon, the most notorious hubcap thief in the history of the planet, has accomplices. Accomplices? Hmm. What was Octavia trying to tell me about Hell's Bikers? <laughs> Hell's Bikers, that's what Octavia was trying to tell me. Hell's Bikers are Giles Gordon's accomplices. I knew it all along. Octavia wants me to expose Giles. And all I have to do is catch the accomplices. Yes. OK, could you move to the right a little? That's it. Things looked pretty hopeless. It was not really. Next. Apparently, hubcap theft is second only to being ugly in Sunset Cove. Something to do with depriving citizens of surfaces for the sun to glint off. I never felt so alone. Mr. Varish for the prisoner! You've got to be able to see his head over your shoulder. Okay, that's beautiful. Hold it there. Man, look at you! The chains, the padlocks. Excellent. Thank you. Pay on your way out. I got itchy through our cannon's great. You want me to help? <sighs> Thanks, Benny. You have to keep things when you get out. That's if I get out. They say the judge likes to make the punishments for the crime. So what? He sends people around to your house and they take the hubcaps off your car. That's crazy. You don't even own a car. You don't even own a car. Oh, look, it's more complicated than that. If I'm found guilty, they'll send me to Sunset Swamps, right? It's magnificent. <sighs> Looks like your luck could be turning, Giles. You don't even own a car. Oh, it gets worse, because they say I have to spend my time there hammering old bean cans into new hubcaps. Oh, now that is gross. Gross? They say I'll get a minimum of 10 years. To Anthony, my love, as the paper cup of life fails to drop from the soda dispenser of destiny and the cool brown liquid of desire, splashes upon the lap of desperation. Bikers, I arrest you. You sure you got the right place? You are Hell's Bikers. Close. Hell's Landscape Gardeners, actually. Blast! It was looking more and more like this was the end of the road for me. Beanie had tried to confess that it was he who stole the hubcap. The things had got a little too profitable around here to allow statements of truth to get in the way. <laughs> you didn't think I'd leave you here to rot. What's this? You ain't seen any prison movies? This is the only foolproof way to get stuff into a jailhouse. Works every time. Glue gun. Can opener, egg beater, tongs, electric cover, 
power drill. Ah, uh, it's a power drill. <laughs> what can I say? See you at home. <laughs> right, that's me out of here. Giles Gordon needs to be saved, because he can be of further use to the Agency. And that is the only reason? What do you mean? You're not developing feelings for him. Feelings which could compromise your impartiality within the Agency. No. Then we'll see what can be done. In the meantime, I have information on other agents working for the Dark Side. I don't think so. Oh, you go to the feet? No problem. We get those toes tap to the beat. Hell's dance specialist at your service. From the top. <laughs> Word came today from the hexagon itself that the prisoner. Our prisoner, my prisoner, is to be set free. Now I know that this will come as a bitter blow to all of you, the law enforcement personnel of Sunset Cole. I want to thank you for your support. God bless you all. God bless Sunset Cole. I'm sorry. Stop filming. I, I can't do this. Never know how it is. Quick, point the camera this way. Look what I got. Arrested for wanton destruction of a public utility. Vermont, Commander, Sunset Cove, military, 1 to seed pot 2. Seed pot 2, what has happened to you? It was good to be free again. And to know I had friends who cared about me. What I didn't understand was the sudden decision to let me go. Hi, Giles. Wow, you didn't suppose... Nah, Octavia couldn't have... I mean, why would she? She's a girl of my dreams. Could I ever dare to hope? That sure would be one in the eye for Josh Montana. Charles Gordon, I want to work with you. Oh dear. Oh dear. Huh? Oh well. But if it wasn't Octavia, who was responsible?